Hey everybody, I'm about to introduce myself and this video series for those of you out there who are new to guns. But first, we gotta please that algorithm. So we're gonna ask you to comment on this video and subscribe to the Vortex Edge YouTube channel, but not just for free. We're gonna give you the chance to win a brand new unreleased product at the time of the release of this video, at least, and it's gonna be the perfect addition to a pistol, which we're about to explain to you is the perfect first gun. So go ahead and watch this episode, enjoy, and don't forget to enter to win. If you stumbled across this video, the chances are for whatever responsible reason, you've decided to be a gun owner. And that's awesome. I've been there before. Everybody behind the camera here has been there before. Most people that I work with at Vortex have also been there before. If it's your first time, the whole process can seem a little bit complicated and even a little intimidating. Now it's my job over this whole series to demystify the whole gun buying, ownership and using process because it's really not bad at all. In fact, it's pretty awesome. And if you're one of the good guys, it's also not weird or suspicious at all. Don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious. Oh, don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious. Now, in order to do this properly, we're gonna have to assume nothing, absolutely zero. Because for those of you who are truly new to guns at this point, any of the phrases and other stuff that you might see people throwing at you in other videos, really they don't mean anything yet. I've been around guns 10 plus years myself, and I'm around a lot of other people who have been around guns for quite some time themselves as well. I'll do my best to keep myself honest with some of those phrases and terminologies that I use, but certainly if you hear anything that raises a question mark, let us know in the comments below so you can also keep us honest. There are no stupid questions. None. No, none, there aren't, probably not. Probably. I don't think there are. I'm Jimmy, and this is New to Guns. So, you're new to guns. This is the right video for you. We'll assume at this point, you don't even own one yet. So we're gonna talk about why a pistol, just like the one you see in front of me here, is the perfect gun to get as your first firearm. One of the most important pieces of advice I can give to somebody who is a first time gun owner is actually use it. A pistol, in my opinion, is the most usable of all the firearm types because it's so versatile. It can be used in all kinds of different applications, activities, etc. Now you may be looking to get this first firearm for the purposes of home defense, self-defense, something like that. A pistol is an excellent candidate for either one of those. Now, hopefully, you're not finding yourself in home defense and self-defense scenarios all the time. And since you wanna be shooting this gun to get used to it and to get accustomed to it and just to enjoy your investment, then you're gonna to wanna to use it for other reasons too, like common range days. Just about every local range that you might find yourself in is probably going to allow you to shoot your handgun in some capacity. They may not allow you to shoot a long range rifle, an AR-15, which is a type of rifle that we'll get into here in a bit, or maybe the limitations of the range and size and everything itself may just not lend itself very well to those other types of firearms. A pistol can just about always be used. Once you get more practice in, maybe your competitive side starts to come out a little bit and you think, how can I really see if I'm actually getting any better? Or is there any way that I can compete against other folks here at the range? There's all kinds of competitions that involve the pistol, either in part or only pistol. And because the space restrictions are much smaller for a pistol, then chances are you're gonna be able to find it at just about any local range. Again, even if you're in a northern climate like we are and it's winter time and you're stuck to indoor ranges, most of the time if you're on indoor ranges and they're running competitions, they're going to be just pistol competitions. Of course, you're watching a Vortex Edge video series here and being that we are a firearms training entity, we tend to get a little bit nerdy about things like shooting fundamentals and mechanics. And why is that? Because the smartest scientists in the entire world all agree Nowhere else are those fundamentals more important than with the pistol. And I can tell you that for a fact, the pistol is probably the least forgiving of all types of firearms. But once you train with it, you hone those fundamentals and you start shooting a pistol well, all of those things are gonna transfer over to all the other types of firearms. And really it's actually gonna make shooting just about anything else, long range rifle, your hunting rifle, again, that AR-15, something like that, so much easier. You're really gonna appreciate that this is where you started. One of the most important reasons to go out and buy a pistol is because, now this is assuming that those of you watching are responsible, law-abiding American citizens, it's just because you can. That's an awesome reason in and of itself. 
Last but not least, if we look at all of these great use cases for a pistol, and you consider the fact that in order to get a really excellent quality handgun, it's not that considerable of an investment, all things considered and relatively speaking. If we look at other firearms, like rifles especially, when we start looking at getting high quality items and things like that, the investment can be significant. This is your first time, so you don't have to spend all that much money. And in my opinion, you're getting the best bang for your buck, being that you can use this thing so much. So there you have it, a whole new video series just for you. And we gave you some great information right off the bat to start. We're gonna have more videos going into where to buy that pistol, how to buy, the buying process, and also how to use that gun once you actually own it. We're also gonna talk about other guns in the future too, because they're pretty sweet as well. Remember, if you have any questions at all, or if for whatever reason we've mentioned a terminology or something like that that you're not quite getting, let us know, because we wanna make sure we correct that so that everything makes sense. Again, this is a zero assumptions video series for those of you who are truly new to guns. Welcome, we'll see you on the next one. You need a tutorial before you start? <laughs> yeah, it's a gun range. I think I got it. Wait, I think I did it wrong!